Good evening. Welcome back. Nakshivan News Information Program is on the air with the most significant events held last week. One of the important events was about the extraordinary and plenipotentiary ambassador of Luciana to Azerbaijan and his visit to Nakhchivan. As you know, the chairman of Supreme Majlis of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic received the ambassador. Firstly, let's watch official news. On November 14, the chairman of Supreme Majlis of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, Mr. Vasif Talibov, was met by the extraordinary and plenipotentiary ambassador of the Republic of Luciana to our country, Egudis Navikas. The chairman of Supreme Majlis congratulated the ambassador on the occasion of his diplomatic mission to Azerbaijan and stressed out the importance of his visit to Nakhchivan. Mr. Vasif Talibov drawing the attention of the ambassador of Egudis Navikas to agriculture, education and tourism in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic expressed his full confidence on furthermore mutual corporations. Expressing his satisfaction and implementation of diplomatic mission to Azerbaijan, the ambassador of Luciana Republic touched on the current collaborations in the countries. The ambassador of Luciana Republic within his official visit to Nakhchivan was in different production fields, museums and also met with the students. Also during those past days, various important events dedicated to state flag day were held. Some seminars and trainings included a number of actual problems of the health cares were held in Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic. Medical faculty of Nakhchivan State University celebrated its 20th jubilee. Our program goes on with social economic news. Extraordinary and plenipotentiary ambassador of the Republic of Louisiana to our country, Egidis Navikas led flash flowers at the monument of national leader Heydar Aliyev to have been erected in Nakhchivan and in addition got acquainted with Heydar Aliyev Museum. Afterwards, the ambassador visited a number of industrial facilities of the Autonomous Republic, Nakhchivan Business Center and Duzdag Physiotherapy Center. Within his framework visit, the ambassador also met with students of Nakhchivan State University and visited culture monuments. An event on the occasion of the 81st anniversary of Mustafa Kemal Atatürk was held in the General Consulate of Turkey in Nakhchivan. The event participants visit the monument of Mustafa Kemal Atatürk erected to him in Nakhchivan. The memory of Mustafa Kemal Atatürk and also the martyrs who died for Turkey and Azerbaijan was commemorated in a silence moment, let fresh flowers and rests in front of the monument. The conference was attended by the officials of the Autonomous Republic, employees of the General Consulate of Turkey to Nakhchivan, Turkish businessmen operating in Nakhchivan, intellectuals and students respectively. Both November 9th, National Flag Day and November 12th, Constitution Day of the Republic of Azerbaijan were celebrated in Kars, Turkey. The event held by the initiative of General Consulate of Azerbaijan to Kars and with the organizing initiative of the students studying in Erzurum and Kars provinces of the Republic of Turkey. And along with this, the representatives of local community, media and non-governmental organization participated at the very event. The event on eternal comeback day of tricolor flag was held with the participation of the staff of Nakhchivan Department of Azerbaijan National Academy of Sciences at National Flag Museum. All speakers emphasized the importance of the National Flag Day and also the high attitude towards our state attributes in our autonomous republic by the state and people, the spiritual and cultural unity of the world Azerbaijanis, the national flag, our national independence, our freedom and our statehood.
For the purpose of holding International Youth Week on 10th and 17th November, a special action plan was worked out by the Youth and Sport Ministry of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic, Youth Foundation and New Azerbaijan Party of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic. Due to this action plan, the traditional Khamsa intellectual game among the youth and let's know Azerbaijan of the same game among foreign students were held, and subsequently the competition entered the clubs of Mary's and resourceful and table tennis covering high schools and middle special educational institutions, as well as badminton, volleyball, running of light athletics championship. And following the event at the end of the DC Patriotic film was demonstrated. With this the above mentioned Student Youth Week was over and winners of different nominations were rewarded. On November 15, seminars on the protection of state secrets, organization of cadre and ecological works were held in the state by these enterprises and organizations of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic. Medical Faculty of Nakhchivan State University, which was established by the initiative of the Chairman of Supreme Majlis of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic and with personal protection of National Leader Heider Aliyev, started its activity in 1999 and engaged to doctors' preparation. On November 15, the Twinies Jubilee of the faculty was celebrated. Following this event, a special video slide connected with the 20 past year was demonstrated. Afterwards, a tea set hosted the event. Then the participants were able to see the exhibition dedicated to delicious candies and specific national meals. Then a group of students said to be distinguished in the public life of the faculty actively were rewarded with edits. Specialized Middle Police School of Ministry of Eternal Affairs of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic hosted the students of Social Management and Law Faculty of Nakhchivan State University. The students in the school saw the condition and modern technical facilities created at the practically. Anar Valiyev, the Dean of the Faculty of Public and International Relations of Azerbaijan Diplomatic Academy, and Leila Aliyeva, a student admissions officer with the Nakhchivan State University. The event held at the Faculty of International Relations and Foreign Languages, University Scientific Potential, Material and Technical Base, and on international projects carried out in the university were informed. During the lectures delivered in mutual atmosphere, the students' questions were answered in detail. The next event was held at the executive power of Nakhchivan City of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic with State Head Insurance Agency on insurance deals and perspectives embracing this matter was mutually discussed. It also was noted within 10 months of this current year 16,920 insurance contracts were signed. The first regional conference on the problems and solutions of hemophilia was held in the Republic Hospital of Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic. The conference attended by Association of Hemophilia Patients of the Republic of Azerbaijan and the employees of the Advanced Training Institute named after Aziz Aliyev Practical View Exchange were carried out. Nakhchivan Autonomous Republic Hospital hosted a conference on healthy future with young people. 
At the conference with the participation of young people, the speech on the seems depression in young people, ways of escaping, spinal cord problems, causes and prophylaxis of oral cavity diseases, diseases caused by harmful ultraviolet races and their protection, finished foods and their complications were heard. The questions arising by participants were discussed and analyzed at the conference. In Shahpur's region, medical employees were enlightened on report preparation connected with compulsory medical insurance. In the course of the event, the speakers dealt with the process of report receiving, the medical entity and its registration. Together with this, the principle of compulsory medical insurance, its purpose, services directed to population, working out monthly reports and other issues were analyzed completely. An event dedicated to the International Day of the Visually Impaired was held at Nakjivan Regional Information Center for People with Disabilities. At the event, gifts were given to those from that category and they expressed their thankfulness for the shown care. Those who couldn't participate, they were visited at their homes. Totally 300 visually impaired persons in the Autonomous Republic were presented gifts. Kangali Region Central Hospital held an enlightenment event on the occasion of Day of Diabetes. The event focused on the establishment of World Diabetes Day, the measures taken on sugar diabetes due to the state program, the care of patients, the material technical base created in this field and work done in the health education works. Starting from last week, apartments in Nakjivan were provided with heating system. In this season, 7,634 apartments and 30 administrative buildings in 173 residential buildings will be heated through five centralized, 38 individual boiling houses. Boiler engineers who work in boiling houses were received certificates at Nakjivan Regional Vocational Training Center. Sher Region Education Department hosted the closing ceremony of the third grant prize for innovative teachers with the participation of active teachers from the region. Training started from September to were held with the participating some of secondary school teachers of the region. Certificates were presented to the teachers who actively participated in the training. An event entitled Artist Son of a Great Artist was held in St. Javits Home Museum and Memorial Complex. Her total Javits life and creativity was heard at the event dedicated to her total Javits Memorial Day, speech on literature of her total Javits, her total Javits image in Azerbaijan literature, her total Javits section of the museum foundation were listened, then the exposition of the museum was viewed. In the Autonomous Republic, the total area of new orchards and green stripes are expanded. A new nut garden was planted in Havush village of Sheru region. The garden amounted with 5.5 hectares already obtained 600 nut seedlings. But roads along of Hoch and Kengel regions, 1,500 mulberry seedlings were planted. Seedlings made with agrotechnical cares. And about 600 evergreen trees were planted in the cemetery area of Hoch village. For the first time in the Autonomous Republic, the International Mathematical Olympiad was held among young mathematicians. Totally 139 students from a number of secondary schools of the Autonomous Republic partook in the Olympiad.
the all-round intellectual game among young civil servants started. 186 young civil servants from 31 state bodies took part in the intellectual competition for the first time, the next stage of the tournament to be held on November 22. Following the program, cultural and sport news are to your minds. A number of concert programs and sport competitions dedicated to state flag day were held in Nakjevan Autonomous Republic indeed. Already it's clear that a new fitness center has been put into operation in Nakjevan. It's an honor for us to say that the police employees have submitted new objects to the museums. People of Nakjevan Autonomous Republic could find leisure times to watch the performances of Seattle collectives last week. Presentation of material and cultural samples donated to the museums by the police employees of the Ministry of Eternal Affairs of Nakjivan Autonomous Republic was held. The exhibits are expected to be found at Nakjivan State History Museum Khan Palace, State Museum of Architecture, Memna Khatun Toma Museum Complex in the Open Air, Nakjivan Gala Historical and Architectural Museum Complex and other museums exposition. 18 different antique items, 6 rifles, 1 pistol and cartridges were donated to the museums by volunteers. Performance The Dead and the Mad based on the motifs of Jalil Memegul Zaide was performed at the Cultural Palace of Sederag. The spectacle was met with great interest by the region community. The collective of Nakjivan State Puppet Seattle performed the well-known poetry and playwright on at art figure Kemal Agayevas took the Khanum performance to the pupils and school children at the Shapuz Region Cultural Palace. The play took the Khanum based on the motifs of the Azubajani folk tale gave the students a cheerful mood. Events dedicated to the National Flag Day were held in Babak and Julfa regions. The event attended by the employees of departments, enterprises and organizations, different songs and dances were performed at the very event. A new gym called Absolute Fit was launched in Nakjivan City. All conditions were created for teenagers and youth going in for sports. Sportsmen applying to the fitness center will be trained by male and female professional specialists. Within the framework of the International Student Youth Week on November 10, 17, a volleyball championship was held among boys and girls from higher and secondary special education institutions. Six teams competed in the Olympic system. Nakjivan City Open Boxing Championship was held among teenagers and young men. About 70 athletes challenged in the sort of weight category in the competition dedicated to the 9th November National Flag Day. Athletes were rewarded with diplomas by the organizers. The Autonomous Republic Championship on Paintball was held among the Azerbaijan war participants with limited physical abilities. The competition was co-organized by the Ministry of Youth and Sports of Nakjivan Autonomous Republic and together with the Paralympic and Shooting Federations. Then the winner teams were given cups, diplomas, medals, gifts and coupons.
chess championship among Paralympians was held in Babek region. The competition took place at the region children's and youth chess school. In the championship organized by the Babek region executive power, 32 limited physical ability won challenge to be winners. The winners received diplomas from the organizers. Esteemed television watchers, that was all for today. Hopeful to see you next Monday at the same time. Good night.